more people, but I guess when Stevie Wonder canceled, it just it just trickled down. Nobody came. <laughs> Everybody. But the good thing is this will be on YouTube like in 20 minutes, so if I screw up, you can watch it again and be like, yeah, I screwed up. I'm gonna leave a comment. <laughs> I like, uh, I like these open mic things. You can basically say anything, but since it's at school, you can't really say anything funny. Like, uh, I don't know, no swear words. That's kind of, I, I want to swear, man. It's not fair, come on. But I like using this mic. I like, I like using this mic because whenever you use this mic, instantly anything you say is about like 100 times better because it's amplified and you're like God for some reason. <laughs> I could say literally anything like that. Shenanigans. <laughs> Waffle crisp. Wingo boingo. <laughs> it's peanut butter jelly time. <laughs> and uh, well, that's a good thing to do. I like stand-up comedy on a whole. I consider myself a veteran. I've been doing this for about six hours. <laughs> and uh, I, I don't know about you, but I hit a really big career slump about uh, like 2.15 today. <laughs> I just got addicted to Flintstones chewable vitamins, and like, oh man, I needed my Bam Bam fix. It was, it was pretty bad. You know, it's bad when you're selling your blood for like children's aspirin pills. I don't know. I wrote everything down today because I have a really bad memory. I don't know about you. I've tried like that new memory medication, but I can't remember where I put it, so it's like catch 22 right there. I guess my biggest career slump was about 6 o'clock today. Uh, I was a mess. I didn't know what I was doing. I exposed myself to the Academy Awards, and uh, yeah, that's, that's, that's a hard thing to follow, just exposing yourself in front of like everybody. But, you know, back on track. I have no idea what I'm doing right now. I, anything you hear right now is basically the first, I'm hearing it for the first time, so, you know, we're, we're just both, like, we're in for something great or something completely terrible. Think about terrible. Uh, let's see, um, being a comedian is a hard job, but it's not as hard as high school. Uh, that's all I gotta say. One thing I remember before I came to high school, my mom said this really inspiring thing to me. She said, she said, uh, Kurt, my boy? High school is the best years of your life, so you make the best of it. And of course, my dad would say, Kurt, I would not want to be you right now. <laughs> These are the worst years of your life. Get out now. Go to Mexico. <laughs> it's simple. Everybody does it. Uh, let's see. <laughs> high school's not that bad, actually. It's just like the people and things in high school... I don't really like. <laughs> it's like, I don't know, there's this thing called the hyphy movement. Anybody know about it? Oh, uh, yeah, you guys love it, don't you? Yeah. It's just like, yada na mean. What does that mean? Yeah, has it, has it actually come to the point in society where we're just, we're not even saying sentences anymore. We're saying one long continuous word saying, like, everything we have said to sum everything up. You're like, yeah, man, I went to McDonald's one day, and I just, I don't know what I'm going to mean, bro. I just get a whip, you know what I mean? <laughs> and, like, ghost riding the whip. <laughs> Where the heck did that come from? <laughs> it seems like it's completely just, like, something that came out of the teenage mind. It was just, maybe it was just some guy driving a really crappy car, broke down on the side of the road, instead of putting it in a park, put it in neutral. And it just rolled down the street. It was like, Give it, hey, hey, I need assistance, need assistance. Oh, yeah, yeah, put on your thin face. I don't even know what the hell that means. <laughs> You never see any, like, d refined English businessman go like, Well, um, what did I do today? I, um, what did I do? I, uh, signed a bill that eliminated poverty in the Eastern sector. I, um, I cured cancer using a thimble and lemon juice, and, uh, I ghost rode the whip. So... <laughs> Yada I mean? <laughs> And that's the, you never seen people like soccer moms ghost riding the whip. <laughs> mom, mom, help! Push the brake. We're headed for a clip. Oh yeah, Billy, put on your thiers face. Put it on. <laughs> oh. 
I just don't know how it works. 